Hello everyone, my name is iTrooper and welcome back to a, another video. Today I'm going to show you guys how to install a Siren mod into your guys' 5M server. So it pretty much works for every single Siren mod going. It's pretty much the same. So if you guys want to install a different one, then feel free to do so. They're quite scarce to come by when it comes to a 5M ready one, but there is quite a few out there. So if you are lucky enough to find them, then feel free to use those instead. But if you want to use this one, it is down in the description below. All you guys are going to want to do is click download this file and you guys should be given a choice between a resident.rpf and a weapons underscore player.rpf. This one right here is going to be a mod for weapon sounds. If you want louder, more realistic gun sounds, you can install this one right here. And if you want your realistic sirens, you can install this one right here. And obviously you can install them both if you want. We're going to be installing them both. So we're just going to download both of them together at the same time. So we'll install that one first and then we'll go back and we'll also install our weapons player.rpf as well. And when they're both installing, all you guys are gonna wanna do is now find our GTA 5 main directory. So unlike making any 5M server mods, we're not gonna have to put it into our 5M or our 5M server directly. It's actually gonna be in our GTA 5, just like modding GTA 5 story mode. So all you guys are gonna wanna do is navigate your GTA 5. If you guys are on Steam, I'm gonna show you guys how to get to that right now. If you're on Rockstar Games or Epic Games, that is down in the description below for your file directory. So for Steam, all you guys are going to do is go to whatever drive your Steam games are installed on, program files 86, and then go to Steam, Steam Apps, Common, and then GTA 5. And all you guys are going to want to do is find your x64 folder, then go into the audio folder and SFX, and this is where we're going to put our mods. So you guys should be able to see somewhere down here is our resident RPF, and somewhere up here will be our weapon sounds. So all you guys, are, well, right here even, that's gonna be our weapon sounds. So all you guys are gonna do is replace these with what we just downloaded. So put that on the side and open up your downloads folder by right clicking on the file icon and opening a, another folder on up. Go to downloads, you guys should be able to see here, unless my resident RPF hasn't finished installing yet. It just has, there we go. And all you guys are going to do is very simply grab these two, control and left click on both of them and drag and drop them into your guys' GTA 5 folder, just like so, and move them into your SFX folder. And now since they're already there, they're already a thing and we're replacing them with better, more realistic sounds, it's going to ask you to replace the two files with the same name. Hit replace the files in the destination and just like that, you now have custom GTA 5 siren sounds and weapon sounds. Hope you guys did find this video useful. If you did, Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Comment down below what video you guys want to see next. And if you guys are in the market for a 5M server or even a Minecraft server, literally any game server in the world, then be sure to check out the channel sponsor, Zap Posting, down in the description below and use code Highway Trooper, no capitals or spaces for 20% off your next product with them. And one final note, if you guys did want to remove this, all you guys would have to do is come back to the same file location in your SFX folder and simply delete what we just installed, so our resident and our weapons player, the RPF, and then you'd have to verify your game files and it will reinstall all the original files again for you. It will reinstall the weapons and the resident, the RPF file. So then you're back to normal and nothing to worry about. So other than that, I'll see all of you guys in the next video. Cheers and goodbye.